Hello, friends. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start, please, like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon, thanks. Prince Andrew has reportedly told friends he has no intention of leaving his Windsor estate after signing a £250 a week lease for 75 years. There are mounting suggestions he may be forced out after the King indicated he would slash Andrew's allowance of £250,000 by April as part of his plan to reduce royal costs. But the Duke of York has spent millions of his own cash over the years renovating Royal Lodge to his own likings and has indicated he won't leave without a fight. An insider told the Mirror, he, said, he's not leaving, there is no chance that will happen, and even if the king wanted him how would that work? If he, the king, wants to spend millions reimbursing him for the money he's already spent on the property, that's another matter. Could you imagine a situation where the duke threatens to sue his brother, the king, over money? It would be unthinkable. And Andrew does have some grounds to argue his case to stay. In 2003, Andrew signed a 75-year lease on the property, which has a swimming pool and 98 acres of land. The Duke stopped receiving public money when he was forced to step down from royal duties following sexual abuse allegations by Virginia Jufrey, which he denies. In February 2022, he agreed to an out-of-court settlement with Ms. Jufrey, estimated to be around $12 million. The settlement was not an admission of liability. Last June Sarah Ferguson purchased a £5 million property in Belgravia as an investment. But a source told The Sun all talk about moving a tenant in has suddenly all gone quiet amid the reports they could be forced out of their Windsor home. They are looking to keep it empty to use themselves, the insider said. So what do you think about this news guys? Please, Share your personal opinion with us in the comments section below. Thank you.